Hey, hey, Mike here. So this is interesting. Have you seen the news on Open Tofu? Let's head on over to that. Look at this, Open Tofu. So it appears that the OpenTF, which obviously, as you may or may not know, when HashiCorp changed the licensing around specifically all of their products, but specifically Terraform, everyone sort of got a little annoyed. They weren't really too happy about that, which I can totally understand. And so they created OpenTF, but now due to a potential issue around trademarks and naming, they've come up with a new name from OpenTF because obviously Terraform as a phrase may be a trademark, probably is a trademark. And so HashiCorp may take issue with that and they may be forced to sue. I don't know if you know this, but if you own a trademark and you don't defend it and you don't actively sue people who violate it, you lose the trademark. I'm not a lawyer, but that, that's my understanding of it anyway. So they would indeed actually have to sue. And so here we go. We have Open Tofu. I think it's a pretty cute name, Open Tofu. It doesn't tell you much about what the underlying product is, but then, well, I guess Terraform does as a word. It's very clear what, what, what that means. However, Tofu doesn't really, but it is super cute. I love the, I love the little box here. That's, that, that's pretty adorable. It, awesome. So the Linux Foundation announced the formation of Open Tofu, an open source alternative to Terraform's widely used infrastructure as code provisioning tool. Previously named OpenTF, Open Tofu is an open source community driven response to Terraform's recently announced license change from Mozilla Public License to a business source license, providing everyone with a reliable open source alternative under a neutral governance model. Very interesting. I think it's really, really cool. I like the some of the sponsors that are that are be that have been involved here. Let me get this uh, let me get this zoomed in a little look at the stupid thing on the side here can i block that what happens if i can i preview that oh god are you kidding me pick the whole thing what's the whole how do i get rid of the whole thing yeah 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 yeah, yeah. preview yeah look at that create boom thank you oh god i love you block origin so we can see here we've got some great um sponsors we've got harness grunt work yeah space lift m0 scalar digger Terra Team, Mass Driver, Terra Mate, and others are basically pledging time into Open Tofu in order to keep it active. I think that that is wonderful. So it's going to be very interesting to see where this goes. It's now backed by by the Linux Foundation, so that means it's that means it's going to be pr pretty chunky. That means it's not going to be left to the wayside. It's not just a couple of people given an effort to create an open source alternative, a truly open source alternative to Terraform. It's actually being backed by real organizations. So I think this is awesome and I'm really interested to see where this goes. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Are you going to continue to use Terraform, HashiCorp's Terraform, or do you think you'll, you'll switch over to open Tofu and why? Or as maybe this complete change made you shift over to something like the dreaded Pulumi. Ooh, I'm sorry about that. If you've moved over to Pulumi, then my condolences. I do apologize that that's happened to you. Um, let me know in the comments below. Thanks very much for watching. And um, this is going to be an interesting space to watch.